Welcome back, Wastelanders. So today is Tuesday, July the 2nd, and it's time for your weekly Fallout 76 updates. Let's get in everything you need to know. Fajnot Knot continues this week at the top of the hour every hour, so if you have rare masks that you're trying to get, make sure that you're out there trying to get them. Also, we have double XP starting on July the 4th through the 8th, so make sure to take full advantage of that, especially if you've not gotten through the scoreboard yet or season. So good luck to all you. All right, so Fallout first, drink two Nuka-Cola cranberries. Now, if you need help with that, I do have a video going over every, lo well, not every location, 21 locations to be exact, <laughs> that you could find Nuka-Cola cranberries since they cannot be made or bought unless you buy them from a vendor where somebody else has already sold it or a player vendor, basically. All right, Gold Star, complete a daily op on a public team, cripple two ghouls, legs, kill 10 cultists, mod three weapons, and scrap five pre-war money, and then scrap junk to produce 10 steel. You can just scrap a bunch of weapons for that one. And then for our weeklies, we have Fallout First, complete Fallout First, complete a Gold Star Daily Challenge three times. That's for anybody not Fallout First. Claim three workshops, complete three events, craft five, no, 45 energy ammo, craft any plushie at Tinker's Bench three times, eat 25 meat-based meals, eat 25 vegetables, kill 25 cultists, kill 15 mole rats, scrap junk to produce 15 screws, and then the repeatable if you still have that available. And the Atomic Shop, let's see what we got this week. So we have the flag waving bundle that's 1,200 atoms. Oh, look at that little eagle balloon. All right, let's see here. This has the U.S. flag post light em up paint for the Gatlin gun. Stars and Stripes photo mode frame light em up power armor station. American Patriot power armor paint set. Eagle balloon and tricentennial Tesla rifle. And this is 1,200 atoms. And then we have the light em up station. This is 500 atoms, and this is a power armor station. It's a little blocky for me. Sorry, that, the atoms don't know if I like that one. I mean, I see that the lights are on it, so it might look cooler than it is, but it's, it's awfully blocky. Anyway, 700 atoms for the tricentennial paint for the Tesla rifle here. The flag wave emote, or no, pose, is 250 atoms here. Now, a pose is different from an emote. A lot of players seem to be getting that confused here recently. So a pose is something that you do for a photo, like in photo mode. In a moat is it something that you can just do on the fly by using your D-pad or, you know, your arrows on your keyboard or what have you. So that way you can like wave high or whatever. This is just a pose, meaning that you strike a pose and you stay that way. So this one has the flag. And that's 250 atoms there. Stars and Stripes photo mode frame is 150 atoms. And that's what you get there. The eagle is 500 atoms. The American Patriot paint for paint, uh, American Patriot power armor paint sets. This comes with the unique paint for each of the T45, T51, T60, and X01 power armor. So this one's very limited. It does not come on most of the power armors. So do not buy it if you're trying to get it for all those other power armors because you'll probably be sadly disappointed. Every once in a while it works, but not very often. Not enough for you to waste 980 atoms. That's just my opinion. And then the light em up paint is 600 atoms for the Gatlin gun. And this one is on sale, believe it or not, for 20% off. That is so expensive. For the, uh, for the people bundle is 1,800 atoms. Now this comes with the Red Menace Flag 2, the Red Shift Backpack, Communist Threat Paint for the Combat Rifle, Communist Spy Outfit, Communist Spy Ski Hat, Communist Star Player Icon, Communist Fence, Red Shift Paint, Red Menace Flag 1, Communist Bunker, Communist Military Safe. So there you guys go. And then let's see what else we got. We got the same stuff for the Candle Maker. It looks like the Cowboy Bundle is here for 20% off at 1440 Adam. This has the Gunslinger Pose, the Rootin' Tootin' Cowboy Outfit, the Chuck Wagon Cooking Station, Western Revolver American Paint, Rootin' Tootin' Cowboy Hat, Single Action Revolver American Paint, Hay Bales, Laser Light Duck Shooting Gallery, and a 44 American Paint, and the Giddy Up Buttercup Ride. So that's 1440 Atoms. And then we have the Liberty Prime Power Armor Skin, that's 1260 Atoms. This is a unique skin that completely alters the appearance of your power armor. It can be equipped on the Excavator, Raider, T-45, T-51, T-60, Ultra Sight, and X-01 Power Armors. The Power Armor Skin will play new, fully voiced sound effects while equipped. I do believe that you have to have like the chest piece on in order for that to work. So if you're trying to mix and match, just be aware of that. Jamming out bundle is 1,500 atoms. Let's see what's in this. This comes with the pipe organ, industrial street lamps, 
Let's Jam Emote, Resonator Guitar, Drum Set, Classic Performance sta Stage, and the Handbone Stool. So there you guys go. 1500 Atoms. <coughs> Liberty or Death Bundle. That comes with the Tan Free States Backpack, Free States Revolutionary Icon, Free States Paint, Combat Shotgun, Free States Revolutionary Helmet, Revolutionary Paint, Free States Revolutionary Outfit, and Free States Salute for a thousand atoms. And then the Stars Outfit is 720, 720 atoms. This one's on sale. This comes with the Stars and Stripes Dress, Root and Toot and Cowboy Outfit, Stars and Stripes Headband, Root and Toot and Cowboy Hat. The Hoot Nanny Overall Under Armor and the Stars and Stripes uh, Stars and Stripes Ops Under Armor. So there you guys go. Under Armor means it's worn underneath your clothes, unless you're trying to show off your armor that you have wearing over top of it. And then we also have military uniforms and a couple other things here. Let's see here. We got the Tricentennial Bundle. This is 50% off at a thousand atoms. This comes with wow. This comes with the Power Armor Paint Set. The Vault Boy Patriot Head, the commemorative Tricentennial Frame, Tricentennial Posters, Patriotic Uncle Sam Outfit, Tricentennial Paint for the Hatchet, Tricentennial Paint for the Laser Gun, the Tricentennial Salute, Tricentennial Paint that's 10 millimeter. So there you guys go. They got the four poster bed for 350 atoms. Just in case you're interested in getting that. We have the Power Patrol Fatigues at 560 atoms. Then we have military intel uniform at 480 atoms. The military uniform at 480 atoms. And then the 4th of July icon is 75 atoms. We got free Fajnot frog icon, free Nuka Cola twist. The Dr. Zorbo's power armor paint is 30% off for Fallout First members. And that is going to be 840 atoms. We have the communist skin for the handmade at 420 atoms. And then let's see here. The ketchup bundle, that is the same. This is the same from last week. There's the other one is the same. Let's see what else we got. We got the city food truck bundle. This is going to be 1440 atoms. This comes with the butchering cutting board. Right this way, Cappy statues, Nuka-Cola patio sets. Nuka-Cola cast stool, silver barbecue grills, black barbecue grill, street corner salesman, big fridge, trailer, pots and pans, rack. And that's 1440 atoms. And then the clandestine gauss weapons. This is a weapon bundle here. This is for the paints or skins. It comes with for the gauss minigun, clandestine service gauss shotgun paint, clandestine service gauss pistol paint. So there you guys go. If you need it. Uh, paints for those they are available to you and that seems to be it I was kind of kind of sad that they don't have any more Fajnot stuff since we got Fajnot going on and a lot of players are looking for that uh, light up turtle and robot head that they you know gave out in well they didn't give out but sold in February let's see what else they got just in case though we'll just double check because you know sometimes they add stuff in big and tall no, there's the special camp bundle. I don't see anything there. All right, guys, I guess that's it. I hope that you have a wonderful week. Good luck in Fajnot. If you want to stop by and ask any questions, make sure to do so. I'll be live streaming most of the day. Take care, guys, and I'll see you guys in the wasteland.